Israel has vowed to continue striking Hezbollah in Lebanon, with Israeli Foreign Minister Israel Katz saying the group will pay a heavy price for its attacks on northern Israel. In a statement on social media, Katz said that overnight missile strikes targeted Hezbollah's financial infrastructure, warning that Israel will keep hitting the Iranian-backed group until it collapses. Meanwhile, reports indicate that Israel has presented the United States with its demands to end its offensive in Lebanon. Israel's conditions include allowing its forces to prevent Hezbollah from rearming near the border and giving the Israeli Air Force freedom to operate in Lebanese airspace. However, U.S. officials reportedly believe Lebanon and the international community are unlikely to agree to these terms. Hezbollah has reported multiple attacks on Israeli troops near villages along the southern Lebanon border, claiming to have caused casualties, according to AFP. The group stated that its fighters targeted a gathering of Israeli soldiers on the outskirts of Markaba with three rocket salvos, one of which allegedly inflicted casualties. Hezbollah also claimed to have fired on Israeli troops attempting to evacuate the dead and wounded. Additionally, the group launched rockets and artillery shells at Israeli forces near Kefar Kila, intensifying the ongoing conflict in the region.